Hi everyone, this is Santiago Zapata and I am here today in Colombia 4.0, a big tech conference in Bogota, Colombia. And from here we're going to do the launching of the 2022 season of Formula Pro. So we're going to be running the qualifiers for the Miami uh, Formula Pro 2022 Grand Prix. This is going to be streamed live. So we're going to see how the teams are going to do in this news. We have a lot of changes on this season. And from here, uh, we're going to see how the new team, the new cars of the teams and then their new drivers will um, perform. So let's go ahead. The cars are now in their warm-up laps. We see that they're starting some, some position, but it's, just, it's, it's still too early to know uh, how they're going to do once they start with their flying laps. This is a brand new circuit in the city of Miami. And we have a lot of changes in this year's uh, calendar and pilot lineup, especially the addition of Bedoya to the Epona uh, team has a lot of fans wondering how it's going to do after uh, the, the changes from last year and Wickman now is on slash wheel racing. So there are a lot of changes that are expected. We are seeing this new track, it has some very long straights where the cars are developing very high speeds we see that Queenscape is doing some very good laps so far we haven't had any accident and here they are we are almost ready for the flying laps the qualifiers are starting now and we see Wigman crashing that's not a good sign for the start of this season we have now the flying laps on the on the track he with the new addition to queenscape motorsport is doing very good times followed by his teammate biscop her teammate biscop and mendoza also the new addition for the manager just team has crashed so no good news for this last world racing team and for my jocks he with and biscuit biscop are dominating the qualifiers with very similar time, they are followed by Kiselevics on the Epona Nitro car. Equino on Hatena, he in the end decided to join the team again after some um, some rumors of him abandoning the team and going to stock racing, but those turned out to be false. Now we are in the very long straight where Queen's Cave is dominating again, I say. Uh, there are not a lot of changes in the, in the times. This could lose low traction just as he was approaching the finish line and that made him go into the seventh position, a big change. He was uh, almost leading the race, it was going to be a very close contention with Hewitt, but these are the times, the qualifying times for the Miami Grand Prix 2022. Uh, we are going to see Hewitt on, and Kisa Levix on the front row, followed by Simernino and Gekinho. Bedoya and Densi will follow in the third row. Uh, Densi and Biscop and the fourth row. Sorry, am I wrong? Uh, no, that's right. Bedoya and Densi in the fourth row. And uh, we are going to see Biscop and Gabi in the fourth row. And Mendoza and Wigman, they did not manage to finish their qualifiers. Uh, so they are going to be starting at the back of the, of the grid. So that's the qualifiers for the uh, 2022 Miami Grand Prix. I uh, will see you tomorrow for the race.